Hi everyone, welcome along. Today we're talking about draining your heating system. Now if you have a F&E tank, this is the one for you. Uh, if you've got a combi, uh, this isn't the video for you. This is to drain an F&E system, that is a system that's got a hot water cylinder and a little storage tank in the loft. Okay, now most of you will have one of these little items. It's a three-way valve, or possibly two valves, which are called two-way valves, but anyway, what you will find on them is that there's a little lever at the side. Now, when you drain the central heating system out, um, it's a good idea to have this put into manual mode so that the whole of the system will empty. And when it's not on, when it's not working as it's such and the power's off, this thing locks back off so that the, heat, the flow pipe to the heating uh, is kind of locked off. Um, by that I mean, there's our B going to hot water and there's our A going to central heating. If I try to blow through this and put my hand over the, the B port which is for the hot water cylinder, nothing, I can't blow through it. And that's because the valve is locked off the heating side. So when you want to drain it, you want to get all that water out, um, it is right hassle when you have this side blocked. So we use this lever to put it into manual. So look on the side of your valve, there'll be the lever, pull it over and you can hear it go over there, lock it, let it drop back and it will lock in here. It's now in manual mode. When you drain the heating now, it'll all empty. There'll be, it'll be wide open surfaces to let that heating water out, let that hot water go, hot water, what am I on about? Let that um, system drain uh, and you'll get it completely out. Um, when you refill, leave it still in manual mode and it will refill a lot easier. And uh, once it's complete, then you can just pull this lever back Put it, drop it back down and let it drop back to automatic mode when it's all full up and all the air is out of your system. It does help quite a lot if you do that rather than leave that locked off uh, on the auto mode. Just another little tip, if you are putting inhibitor, cleaner or whatever into your system, uh, it does help if you want to drain it and save a few air locks at least. <laughs> okay, just a little seeky tip that one. Uh, all my videos, you know where to go, usual place, Derrick and 33. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.